We're gonna be catching some really cool fish that I haven't seen in months. The water is so dirty. Oh, what is that? Oh, we got one. Oh, there's something big in that corner. Oh, he's hanging on by a thread. You don't see him this big a lot. That was the red tail catfish. Ah! This is actually really scary. I have no clue what that is. My God, are you kidding me? Look at the size of that one. What's up, BFP Nation? Welcome back to another awesome video, guys. Today, we're back in my backyard, and we got something else going on. So I've been keeping some secrets from you guys here in my backyard. Fish that I haven't shown you, ponds that I haven't shown you. I've teased it a little bit, and tonight, we're finally showing you guys one of those secrets. And yeah, I'm really excited, guys. We're going to be catching some really cool fish that I haven't seen in months. Basically, one of my friends, two months ago, he hit me up. He was moving, and he had to get rid of all of his fish. He was a big fish guy, and he gave me all of his fish until he got a new house and had a tank set up for him so i was basically just holding all these fish until he got a new house got the tank going two months later i've been feeding these fish i haven't really seen them because the water is just disgusting in this pond but i know they're in there because the food does disappear so like i said it's been two months and yesterday he let me know that i can just keep these fish that he's not gonna be able to take them in and he just wants to give them to me so i'm really excited now because these fish when we brought them in i was trying not to get too attached to them okay i haven't been looking in that pond i haven't been looking at the fish i've just been feeding them keeping them alive because i didn't want to get too attached to them because i knew one day i would have to get rid of them but now they're mine for good so what we're gonna do we're gonna go into this little pond i haven't shown you it and then we're gonna put them into my actual ponds as my new pets guys his thing was catfish and if you guys know me my thing is catfish too so there's a lot of catfish in there and like i said catfish grow quick it's been two months we don't know how big they are so i'm really excited to you know get an update on these fish see how they're doing and show you guys finally oh my god i've been dying to but i didn't want to show you guys these fish because they weren't really mine but now they are so let's go into the woods the the pond's literally just chucked in the woods so we're gonna go over there show you guys it we're gonna start scooping around and see if we can catch out these fish here we go all right guys follow me deep into the jungle we have this thing very hidden as you can see you can barely see it but this is it right here guys it's just a giant white container it holds a lot of water and it was a perfect spot to just hold these fish i didn't want to put them into one of my actual ponds because you know it would be a lot harder to catch them out once it was time to give them up so we actually used this to transport some koi one day and that's the only thing we've ever used it for we got two openings cut out one right here and then one right here so thinking about it now this might be really hard to catch these fish out oh my god honestly if i'm thinking about it now i'm, I'm like remembering how big they were when they came here that was two months ago they might be too big to fit through this thing and i'm gonna be completely for real with you guys i don't remember all the fish that came in because he had an african cichlid tank and then he had a predatory fish tank he had about 50 cichlids we threw those in here as well who knows if they're alive the catfish might have eaten them but there was a lot of fish a lot of predators i only remember like two off the top of my head yeah if you look in here the water is like very dirty we got these plants on top just for you know natural filtration and aeration so the fish should be good in here so we're gonna get started guys how are you gonna get them if the water's so dirty honestly i don't know i mean we're just gonna do some blind nets i don't know how to drain this thing so we can't do that and yeah we just gotta take some scoops helen you could you could take some scoops really yeah oh this hole is really really small i don't know how we're gonna do this oh look how deep it is oh my god dang this thing is freaking deep oh that's gonna be a lot harder than i first thought it was let's see if i got anything no nope. i'm not really seeing any fish so far but let's keep trying my god dude it's so deep in there come on give me something Oh, do you hear that? In these plants, I think there might be a fish. I heard a fish kick. Please tell me that was a fish. Oh, oh, what is that? Oh, we got one. Helen, it's a silver dollar. Oh my God. I think there was a couple of these guys in here. He had a little school of them. This is so cool. Okay, the fish are still alive. Look how cool that fish is. Now this is a type of silver dollar. I don't know for sure what kind because there's was way too many to remember, but it has these little orange dots. That's actually really cool. It's a nice one. We got a school of our own in an Oscar pond and we'll add this guy to it right now. All right, little guy, there you go into the Oscar army. There's a lot of silver dollars in here. So he's going to be happy. He's got some friends. All right, here we go, guys. We're going to get back into it. We also brought this net with us. It's got smaller holes because I do know there's cichlids in here as well. You think I'm able to fit in here? Um. Oh god, this is scary. Oh no, why am I doing this? Is there something on you? Yeah, it's on my left foot. Ah! Oh my god! 
Oh my God, get me out of here. Okay, I'm done. Well, that proved one thing. There's big fish in here still, because that thing was about this big. No, thank you. I'll stay down here. It doesn't help that the water's so dirty too. You can't even see in here. What the heck? Well, oh, did you see, was that a fish? I think I just had a fish in the net. He got out. We gotta start getting these plants out too. It's gonna be really hard to net with all of them in that. These plants got massive. When I put them in, they were just like little tiny itty bitty plants. So that means one thing, right? If the plants got bigger, the fish got bigger too. Hopefully, I think there's a freaking red tail in here, but he was like really small. All right, that's all the plants out. We can really start netting now. See if we can catch any fish. Do you hear that? There's something big. In, oh, there's something big in that corner. He's hitting the wall. Oh, I got him. Dude, it's one of the Oscars. I remember there was a couple Oscars now. Oh, he's gotten so much bigger, dude. Look how pretty that one is. My God, he looked nothing like that when he got in here. I really wish you guys could see how big they were when they first arrived. They were literally like this big. That is so awesome. Oh, that makes me so happy. He's thriving in there. Let's get him in the cooler. There you go, buddy. We'll get him into the Oscar army in a little bit. That's two fish added to the Oscar army. Let's see what else we can catch, dude. I know there's a couple more Oscars in here, I think. Maybe there's an arowana too. I don't, I don't think so, but. Maybe. We'll. We'll keep a lookout. All right. Oh, oh my God. Holy crap. Oh my God, it's got it. Ow. There's water in my eye. That nasty poop water just got in my eye. Oh no, the fish. I still got him. Oh, he's hanging on by a thread. Oh, that was so close. I almost lost that. Dude, this catfish. I remember this one. Oh, he feels so weird. I'm sure a lot of you are like wondering what in the heck this fish is. And I'll tell you right now, this is called a Lima shovel nose. I think I have two right now, but they are not this big. Believe it or not, this is about a full grown, I think. So he's gotten a lot bigger. You can see how fat he is. I, don't I think know. he's been munching on cichlids. Pro probably, we haven't caught a single cichlid. So I wish you guys could be here to feel this fish right now. Helen, touch him. It doesn't feel like a normal fish. Ew. Yeah, it's like- It feels like skin. Yeah, it literally feels like human skin. There's no slime, there's no scales. And yeah, it's a shovel nose catfish, but this one doesn't get as big as the tiger shovel nose, but it's still really cool. They're really fast fish. Like I said, I got a couple of those guys, but they're not that big. That's literally like a freaking full grown adult. Oh my gosh. Okay, that was one of the catfish that I remembered being in here. Let's keep going and see what else we can find. Oh, my eye is starting to burn. I don't, I don't think that's normal. No, where are we, oh, what was that? Oh, it's one, of, it's one of the cichlids. I don't know what that, is that a tilapia? Did this guy give me a tilapia? I can't tell. No, that's not a tilapia. I don't think he would do that to me because he knows how much I hate him. I don't know what this is, but we'll keep him. We'll throw him in one of the ponds. This guy will go in this cooler where the smaller fish will be. Cause that catfish will probably destroy him. You've seen his belly. He's been munching. <laughs> He's definitely eating good in here. I do feed him tilapia. I'll come here at night and throw tilapia in there. Cause the, oh my God, Helen. Oh my God, a big fish was in there. Okay, I just saw a swirl, like a wake. Something came up. Oh my God, what is this? Oh, I forgot I put, oh yeah, I put this stuff in here. So this is actually good. The cichlids, there might be cichlids in here. It's like a little structure for the fish to hide in. Oh, oh my God, there's a, there's a fish in there. There's a fish. He's flopping out. He's coming out. Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on. Oh, oh my God. It's a Texas cichlid. Look at that. Okay. I must be mistaken because I think that's two South American cichlids in a row. Maybe it wasn't African cichlids. I don't know. It's, it's been two months. Oh, this one. Okay. He's a little bit skinny. So you can tell right there, this guy hasn't been getting uh, enough food. We'll take care of that. We'll put him somewhere a little better and he should get nice and fat. Oh my gosh. That's a really pretty cichlid. All right. And you go with the other one. Is there... Wait, oh, right there, there's another fish in the corner. Do you see him? Come on, buddy, come on out. Oh, there he is. This is so cool. Okay, this makes it a lot easier. I didn't realize that there's actually pieces of structure in this pond. That's another Texas cichlid. Okay, I guess I'm really stupid. There's no African cichlids, it's South American. That's still really cool. And you go with the other one. I don't hear any more fish in here. We'll keep this out so we don't catch it again. I've had enough of this, Helen. You take the lead. <laughs> it's my turn. Maybe you'll catch an arowana. There's, oh, Helen, I forgot to mention. There's actually like five arowanas in here. Yeah. Really? Yeah. I'm a little scared. Have you hit bottom yet? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, you got it. Here, I'll be on lookout. Okay, no, it's like really dirty. You can't see anything. I'm telling you, there's like five arowanas. Really? Yeah, including an Asian arowana. Uh, there's a black arowana. There's a... Australian arowana. I caught a plant. Oh, I thought you caught a fish. I was like, hey, what are you gonna name it? 
<laughs> what? Do you think this is funny? Now, I'm not like a fish expert, but I know that arowana swim in the top. So I feel like you're messing with me. <laughs> I'm messing with you. I'm telling you, they're in here. Oh, what is that? You got a fish. You got a fish. Bring it out here. You actually got one. I don't know what that is, but I saw orange. It's a little bitty Blaco. These used to be my favorite, actually. And then it turned into arowanas? Yeah. Wow, traitor. That's actually, I think, a chocolate Placo. See, that's not like a, I, I think that's called a chocolate. So he's a little bit darker. All right, we'll add him to the cooler. Here you go. What are you going to name him? <laughs> okay, his name is, ooh. no, this one. He's going to get eaten in that one. <laughs> All right. Oh, oh. There he goes. oh, there he goes. He figured out. <laughs> nice job. I'm ready to retire. To retire? You caught one fish. Okay, fine. My turn. I'm going to get back in there. Trying to catch me an arowana. Okay, there I feel... is no arowana. Yes, there is. Oh, what the heck? Look, there's a pipe. I must have put a pipe in here for the catfish. Oh my God. Okay, it's not a catfish. Dude, okay, this is really cool. Okay, I was definitely wrong. These are all South American cichlids. Oh my God. Yes. Okay, that's literally one of the biggest green tears I've ever seen. You don't see them this big a lot. You guys, you see us catch them a lot, but they're little itty babies. They don't got any cool colors, but this one is like almost a full grown adult. He's got some orange on his tail. Yeah, see the orange? That's so pretty. Okay, he was just living in this little pipe. All right, we're gonna add him to the cooler. Here we go. There you go. These are all South American cichlids. Okay, that means like Jack Dempsey's, Texas cichlids, convict cichlids, stuff like that, Oscars. So, Oscars is cichlid? Yeah. Really? Yeah, everything's a cichlid. Oh my. Give me the net. Where'd the net go? No, there was a dude. That was the red tail catfish. The catfish came up. He probably thinks it's feeding time. Wait till you guys see the size of this red tail. If I'm not being mistaken right now, he looks huge. Oh, oh my God. You catch something? Yeah, and it's huge. Look at this. I don't know what that is. Okay, I, I have no clue what this is. It's a catfish. This is getting crazy, you guys. I've never seen one like that before. Actually, wait, I have. The white belly just reminded me. Actually, I think I have one of these. Dude, this is so funny. Look at this. Oh, this one's huge. I think that's like a... I'm trying to think of the name. You guys are going to have to help me out in the comments. Okay, Helen, touch this one. He looks exactly like the other one. Well, he doesn't feel like it. Ew! Oh my god! Ew! Look at his little fin up here. It's like slimy. Look at the whiskers. Oh, that's really cool. Oh, he's like smiling. Yeah, he is smiling. He's happy. <laughs> we'll name him Smiley. Look, he's literally smiling right now. That is adorable. Oh my god, I love him. Okay, that's freaking crazy. He's about the same size. Actually, he's bigger than the Lima shovel nose. I do know I have one. I think he's actually in the Oscar pond, as well as my Lima shovel nose. So we're gonna add them probably in that pond as well. Wow, we're adding everything to the Oscar pond. <laughs> I wish I had longer arms. I don't think arms get any longer. <laughs> Maybe you just reach in there and grab it. Ah! Oh my god. Ah! 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 Are you okay? Why did you tell me to reach in there? I said reach in there, not <laughs> jump in there. I'm probably gonna catch a disease now. My arm was so far down there, I thought I felt something and I tried to reach for it and it, it was over. This is actually really scary because I don't know how big, what the? What are you doing? Helen! Helen, no, no, do what you were just doing. Put the light up against here. To the right more? To the right? Oh my God, I see a fish. Okay, hand in the net. Should I, I see him with your light. Okay, Helen's shining the light through the pond and I can actually see a fish. Ready? Watch. I got him. Did I get him? I got him! <laughs> it worked! Teamwork, Helen. Oh my God, it's huge. Look, another silver dollar. Let's go. Okay, that's the strat right there. Helen shines the light through the pond and I see the fish and I net him. That one's a lot bigger than the other one. All right, Helen, go ahead and put him in the cooler, please. There you go. All right, there he goes. <laughs> All right you do that. I'll, I'll be down here. here. I don't see anything. Oh my God, right there, right there, right there. I see a fish. I see a fish right in this corner. That could be the red tail. Oh, I hit my foot. Oh, he went in this corner, I think. Come on. That felt like the red tail. That was a big one. Oh, I got him. Oh my God, it's another It's another silver dollar. Look at that thing. How many are in here? I thought there was only two. Turns out there's three. This strat is working well. We're catching fish like every net now. We can actually see him through the pond with that light. There, there he goes. goes. Um, I don't see anyone in this corner. Oh, wait, go back. Oh, I literally, okay, I see a fish. Yeah, and that, directly in the corner. We're literally cheating right now. We know there's a fish in this corner, ready? 100% guaranteed. Nothing. Okay. Sadly, I think a lot of these cichlids got eaten. Oh my God, that was a big fish. Oh my God, what is that? Dude, oh my, 
okay, I was wrong. That's a freaking blue Acura. Oh my gosh. I think that's another South American. Yeah, I was dead off. This is another South American cichlid. Very pretty blue color. That's a big one too. Another awesome fish. Let's get him in the cooler. Hey. There oh. he goes. Oh my God, I have a good idea too. Okay, ready for this one, Helen? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna feel around with my feet. Then once I feel a fish, I'm gonna net him. Why didn't I think of that sooner? Oh, okay, give me, give me another. I felt the fish. Oh. Oh, he's coming back at me. <laughs> I wish you guys could see like what I'm... Oh. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. There he is. Oh, I felt him. Did I get him? Oh, I got... What? What on earth is that? Look at the colors on that cichlid, dude. I don't know what this is. I don't remember putting this one in here. What? I have no... Dude, I have no clue what that is. That's really pretty though. It's a big fish. Yeah, that's a giant cichlid. I couldn't tell you though what it is though. I have no clue. It's got some red, blue. Please go down there and help me out. Comment what kind of fish this is. It looks to me, based on the shape and all that, kind of like a South American cichlid. So no surprise there. All right, we're gonna put this guy in with the bigger fish. There he goes. We Wow, we got a lot of fish. I think what we should do, we'll take like a little halftime break, little breather, and we'll go and we'll put all these fish into their new homes right now because I don't have an aerator. And then we'll come back, try to catch the rest. I know for sure there's more fish in there because the fish I felt with my foot was bigger than that and I saw a red tail. All right, so this is the Oscar pond. It's a little murky now. We just got a lot of rain. Whenever we get rain, the pond's murky. Mark up. I don't know why. I'm going to say it. I think every single one of these fish can go in here. That's so funny. We're going to add these silver dollars in first. That one's giant. All right, there you go. Yeah, I wonder how many we have now. We probably have like close to 20. And there goes his friend. Now right here. Oh, dude, he's going to look great in here. Little Oscar going to join the Oscar army. How fitting. There you go, big guy. All right, should we put this one in here? I think he would fit in. Should we put this guy in here? I don't know where else we would put him. I mean, he looks like a South American cichlid. That's kind of what we got going on in the spawn. So you know what? We'll do it. You guys let me know if it's a good fit. If not, we'll just take him out, put him somewhere else. I want to know what kind of fish. It kind of looks like a fire mouth cichlid, like the shape of it, but I've never seen one that color. It might be a hybrid of some sort. Oh, these guys are freaking huge. Oh, there we go. There's Smiley. He's excited to go in his new home. Dude, that's a giant catfish. Okay, there you go. That's a catfish you don't see too often. Like I said, I think I have a couple. I have a smaller one and then one maybe this big. But this guy right here is a really cool fish. The Lima shovel nose. Look at the tail. I love the tails. They're little trailer tails. Beautiful. He's so chubby. He's very fat. Oh my God. His mouth. I don't even know what it looks like, but it looks not normal. All right, buddy. Enjoy. Oh, he's off. Oh, look at him. He's just chilling down there. Sweet. All right, that's all the big fish so far. We got the cichlids as well. We'll just throw all the cichlids we catch into the mystery pond at the end of the video. Let's get back in there. I'm not I'm not getting back in the pond. I'm done. I'm going to stay on ground. I'm going to net around, try to catch the rest of the fish. Here we go. All right, Helen, your turn again. That's a bigger net. That might work a little bit better. I'm coming out of retirement. <laughs> There's four more arowanas in here. There wasn't even one. What do you mean more? <laughs> I'm telling you. Okay, here. I'll do the light trick for you. Tell me if they see anything. Oh, you're just gonna go for it. All right, let's see it. What did you get? Oh my God, are you kidding me? You've got, dude, you've gotta be kidding me. Here, pull him out, no way. Come on, buddy. No way, Helen. That was her first scoop. You've got it, look how big he's gotten. He literally, oh, I wish I could show you guys how big he was. He was literally probably this big. That's crazy how fast they grow. He's like decent size, like he's actually really big. Wow, you just caught a red tail in your first scoop. I'm a little jealous. I think I'm winning. Yeah. This wasn't a competition, but I am winning. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, let's pick him up here. Dude, oh my gosh, look at this. Ow! Ow! Did he go in the koi pond? Oh, that's a good idea. We'll just run him to the koi pond. Helen, brilliant idea. We have a little red tail. You guys, if you saw the last video, the one where that freaking snake invaded my pond, we caught out a red tail. He was probably about half this guy's size, and he lives in the koi pond. So we'll put this guy in there as well. It's perfect. What was that? What was that? All right, here's the koi pond, guys. Oh, oh he's ready to go. Dude, he looks great in there. All right, another addition to the koi pond. We got another red tail. And yeah, that was freaking crazy, guys. Come on a new name for our new red tail. You've gotta be kidding me. Look, there's been a drain on this pond the whole time. You are so silly. Well, I guess we'll start draining it. I think you just pull it. Oh my, <laughs> look how easy that, I'm so stupid. Oh my, this might actually come out of that now that I'm thinking about it. Here, let's put the net under that. Dude. This is gonna drain in like two seconds. Look at this. That's so easy. Okay, we're gonna drain the rest of the pond, I guess. You can see the line of where the water used to be. It's draining so fast. Oh my God, it is. No one's getting past me. Look, just in case any of the little fish get through, we'll catch them. Oh my God. Oh, we got a fish. 
I thought I saw one. What the heck is that? Okay, that's not a cichlid. Dude, I have no clue what that is. I don't remember this one going in there. So that's really cool. There's fish in there that are not cichlids that I forgot about. I don't know what that, I think I've caught those before. Oh my God, look at the water level. We might start seeing some fish now. We're like halfway, dude. This this thing holds a lot of water. If you guys have any ideas on what you want me to turn this into, like what fish I should put in here, maybe we could try to breed something. I don't know. You guys are good at coming up with these ideas. So comment down below what we should add to this pond, what we should do with it. Cause it's big, okay? There's a lot of water in here and it should make for a nice little pond. Oh my God, so much water. Oh, we're down to the, holy. Oh my God, what are those? Do you see those? There's two more catfish right there. Oh, what is that? Oh, there's a little plank out. <laughs> Look at the size of that one. I don't know what these are. I literally, I couldn't tell you what either of these catfish are. Wait, look at that one. That one looks crazy. Okay, we should be able to net them now. We can see it clear as day. Let's do it. All right, let's go for this one. Look at this, right in the middle. Oh, he's really quick. That's, I think that's what I felt with my foot. Remember, I felt a giant fish. That's gotta be him. All right, they're both on that side. Oh yeah, here we go. Oh, I see them both right there. This one looks like a shovel nose. I'm gonna get him. Oh, I got one. I got one, yes! It does look like a shovel nose. Dude, it's huge. Now I know for a fact, this guy was probably about the same size as the red tail. Hold on, wait, look at this. Tiger shovel nose do not have spots on. They got stripes. Do you see that? He's got spots on him. Wait a minute, whoa! That looks like some sort of hybrid or something. I've never seen anything like that. Usually tiger shovel nose, they just got lines on their body. This guy's got spots. That is one cool catfish, sweet. All right, we'll put him in this cooler for now. Let's get his brother. The other one is a lot bigger. Where is he? Oh, there he is right there, right in the middle. Okay, that one has spots as well, but it looks different. It's got like really long whiskers too. Oh my gosh, come on, buddy. Get in the net. That's a big catfish, dude. Oh my God. He's been eating so many cichlids. Oh my God. Look at the size of this catfish. What the heck is that? I don't know what this is, you guys. It's really pretty though. Look how pretty that catfish is. Look how long his whiskers are too. <laughs> so I don't know the name of this one either, but this one, it's darker colored. It's got sort of like a leopard pattern. This is awesome, guys. I told you there's some crazy fish in here and they've gotten massive. Let's add him to the cooler right now and then we'll make sure there's no other little fish left behind. I did see a little plate go in there. All right, buddy. There you go into the cooler. All right, we're getting back in there. This is really the only way to make sure there's no fish left behind. See ya. Oh, there he is. I got the Playco. That's that little Playco we saw swimming around. Oh, he's adorable. All right, I'll hang on to him. All right, I'm not seeing any other fish, but we did get this little guy, a little bitty Playco. We got all the fish out from the little pond and we're gonna go ahead and add some to the mystery pond and then add those monster catfish to the Oscar pond. Shut up. All right, now we're here at the mystery pond. Check it out. We got the albino placo. We got this weird mystery fish. We got this weird mystery cichlid and a normal placo. We're gonna go ahead and add them into this pond. All right, guys, there you go. Now we do have some really cool South American cichlids. What we're gonna do, we're gonna add them to my cichlid pond. Cause if you guys saw the last video, we have a freaking giant snake that was here and he was eating all my fish. Now that we got him out of here, we can start adding fish in there and we know they won't get eaten. All right, check it out guys. These are all the cichlids we're gonna be adding to the cichlid pond. We got a freaking and blue acara, a green tear, a Texas cichlid, two Texas cichlids actually. There they go, swimming off strong. All right, who's first? Oh, we got this guy. Look at him. See, this one's like really cool. He's like really long and slender. He's got those dots. Beautiful catfish, there he goes. We have so many freaking catfish in here. This is basically turning into like a mini predator pond. All right, relax. Got him. Beautiful catfish. Please let me know what kind that is. Sweet guys, so many insane additions. I'm very happy to actually own them now. Now I get to share them with you guys and we can all enjoy them, watch them grow. So if you guys did enjoy this video, please go down there and leave a like, subscribe down below. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.